In Argentina, thousands marched in Buenos Aires Wednesday to mark the 45th anniversary of the 1976 coup that ushered in a bloody U.S.-backed dictatorship, under which as many as 30,000 people were killed and disappeared. Lita Boitano is the president of Families of the Disappeared and Detained for Political Reasons. Lo que estoy sintiendo, que nunca sentí a mis hijos tan cerca como este año. Y mis hijos es parte de los 30.000, son parte de los que uno nunca nombra, se nombra muy poco, más de 10.000 presos políticos, de los miles de asesinados, de la dictadura genocida. Meanwhile, the National Security Archive has revealed new details about how the U.S. government was in direct contact with the coup plotters in Argentina prior to the overthrow of Isabel Perón's government March 24, 1976. Declassified documents show then-CIA director George H. W. Bush briefed President Gerald Ford on a possible coup almost two weeks before it happened. The U.S. government also told the Argentine military in advance it would recognize the new regime. At the time, the State Department was privately acknowledging a coup would lead to, quote, military rule for an extended duration and of unprecedented severity. The U.S.-backed dictatorship in Argentina would continue until 1983.